right, let's see what we have in my basket of bunnies. Here we have, let's start with this little guy. This here is Wesley. His name is Wesley because Wesley from Princess Bride loved Buttercup. And this Wesley here is enjoying himself a nice fat Buttercup for lunch. The painting goes around. There's the bottom, so I would suggest displaying it like this. So the painting goes around the sides, like so. He looks nice and fluffy. Okay. This is Flopsy. Sitting on her cushy blanket by the window and falling over as a Flopsy bunny would do. is Mopsy. She is sitting on a nice wooden floor, munching away at her carrot. Here she is. This little guy is Cottontail. She's a very small bunny. Or he. Could go either way. This one sits up nicely, like this. This little guy of serious expression is McGregor. He is named McGregor because I thought, what if Mr. McGregor came back as a bunny? That would not make him a happy farmer whatsoever to be the very thing he had to chase away. So this bunny is named McGregor. This is the rock underneath, but all of the rest of it is painted to resemble the ground itself. And McGregor popping out of the hole. Hmm. This bunny is Benjamin. He was rather serious looking, popping up amongst the grass. This here, of course, is Peter Rabbit. I tried to emulate the style of Beatrix Potter to the best of my ability. Peter was my thirteenth and final bunny to round out the bunny's baker's dozen. This is Bella. She was the very first of all the bunnies I ever painted. When I first posted her on Facebook, somebody commented, Bella, and I hadn't yet given her a name. And I thought that would be a beautiful name. So she has become Bella, wearing a shiny iridescent flower in her hair. She is sitting on some kind of basket-like thing in front of the window. And she does sit upright when you sit her down. There's your bottom. This little guy is Cinnabon. I nicknamed him Bun Bun because my little son wanted me to name one of the bunnies Bun Bun. So Cinnabon's nickname is Bun Bun. We have Stella. She is the starry lop bunny. There's the bottom. And the squirrels have something to say. <laughs> there we go. This is Pepper. Her rock is pretty big and heavy. She is coming out at nighttime. 
she stands up like this. So the painting goes all the way around the other side with Pepper on this side. And there's her bottom that she stands up pretty strongly on. This rock is the largest of the bunny rocks. Her name is Violet. My daughter wanted me to paint a bunny whose name was Violet. So this little one became Violet. Looks kind of like a donut from the side. This is my favorite rock of all. This is Ruby. She is brand new, being held by two loving hands. There's the back side. Ruby.